Welcome to Philip Capital Weekly Market Watch. I am Kai Wen from Philip Global Markets. Last week, I have shared on the possibility of a US market heading for a correction from the research covered by our research team. For this week, I will be talking about the impact of from Brexit and the fear on the current equity markets. Due to correction in the US equity market and concern from Brexit fear, safe haven currency like the Japanese yen and Swiss franc has been appreciating. The world equity indices for the last one week has indicated that all major indices like S&P, AK225, DAX, Shanghai Composite Index and the Brazil Stock Exchange Index has been reversing down. The volatility will continue until we see more positive news coming from the EU referendum. The upside will come when Brexit do not take place. Reason for market volatilities are from increasing support from the Brexit camps, surge in the Japanese yen due to the fear in the current markets and the BOJ, BOJ policies, and lastly the uncertainty in Fed direction. The fear and uncertainty in the financial market is highlighted from the VIX movement. Since the start of June 2016, the VIX has increased around 60%. VIX is known as the fear index. It represents one measure of the market's expectation of stock market volatility over the next 30 days period. The uncertainty was also caused by the diminishing expectation of Fed members of a uh, two rate hike this year due to the pessimism in the financial market. Key level for the S&P 500 index is at 2050. A break and close below the 2050 short term level will indicate bearishness and the index should head towards the 2000 support level. A failure to break the 2050 level would see that the index going higher to 2100 level. The chart shows the EU referendum poll taken in recent week and we can see that there's an increasing support for the Brexit movement. The uncertainty for the UK or the Britain to remain in EU has caused the GBP or the pound to depreciate across all the other currency as shown in the chart against the US dollar, Sing dollar and Japanese yen. The impact from the fear and currency weakness has flown into the equities markets. For the FTSE 100 index, the major support is at 5,500 levels and the index has been trading lower and is reaching its critical support level. However, there are still some bright sparks in the FTSC 100 members. Here, there is a list of the year-to-date top performance. Our view is that Brexit would be negative for the world and Britain and the odds of it happening is very low. If it did not happen, we should see a relief rally and we should expect a rise in the GBP or the pound and also on the equity markets which is the FTSE 100 index. We have a list of top cheapest counter measured by the price to book value. And the highest estimated dividend use counters for investors to consider in this current market weakness. Lastly, I would like to highlight that the counters is available for online trading on Poems 2.0. Most of the counters are denominated in pens. Investors can also settle their trades in either GPP, Pound or Sing. With this, we have come to the end of this week's edition of Market Watch. For more information on the risks and returns of investing in UK markets, you may approach any representative from Philip Securities. Please subscribe to us on Philip Capital YouTube channel and Facebook page. Stay tuned for more Market Watch video. Thank you.